God of covenant and faithful promises, yeah. Time and time again, you have proven you'll do just what you said.
to the setting, say my way.
And you say to yourself, I didn't even know it rained over here. But there's a difference when it comes to oil. Even motor oil, anything with oil drips, it leaves a stain. It leaves something to let you know that oil has been there. And oil does not go away just like that. Oil is something that if you get it on your clothes, you can't get it out all. You've got to go through a lot of changes to get it out. And even if someone anoints you with oil, have you ever been anointed with oil and oil? Amen. You can't be from out and they just spread the oil all over the head. And when church was over, you were sort of feeling something. You said something and you were hitting your head, trying to figure out what was going on. And then you thought about it. And you touched yourself and said, they did anoint me with oil. But that oil had a slow shrinkling. It was just coming down your head, coming down there. And you were just trying to get it off. Why? Because oil doesn't run fast. Oil is slow. And tonight, we want to tell you, if you want to think about the oil of joy, if you want God to touch you, to revive you, to give you restoration, to touch you, to do something and bring you up, to give you the God of praise, to help you tonight, I want to tell you the oil of joy will help you tonight. God is getting ready to anoint your head with oil. Uh, your cup is getting ready to run over. Something good is getting ready to happen for you. Something is getting ready to break the all of joy. It's going to come and you're going to experience in just a few days that you can't shake it. I'm through here. But when this all hits you, you won't be able to shake it. You won't be able to get rid of it. You won't be able to shake it. It's going to run you for a few days. It's going to be that slow drag anointing. That slow drag all that drips on you. This all of joy, I promise you, is going to leave a stain. The Lord bless you and the Lord keep you is my prayer.
within our home to help you create a space in your home because we realize we're not the only family that has experienced loss after loss this year. We're not the only family that's hurting. We're not the only family that's grieving. But we know God is God. He's the healer of hearts. He's the comforter. He will anoint us with the oils of gladness. Yes. He will give us beauty for our ashes. So we thank you for tuning in. And we pray that somebody was touched and encouraged and, and uplifted. How you?
understanding of the Cheyon. Cheyon. Come on. That God will give you joy in the midst of yeah. it. While you're mourning, while you're grieving. Oh.